Hey guys, welcome back to the Ron Williams YouTube channel, soon to be your champion life. I know you've been hearing me say that, but we're in the process of uh, switching it over. Now, what we're talking about today is COVID-19. And we're, 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 we're going to talk about what it requires to navigate through this. One thing our president said is that we're in a warfare against a, an invisible enemy. Well, the enemy is the coronavirus. One thing we need to do is make sure we build our immune system. And I've written down six things that we can do to actually help us build our immune system to be prepared for if, if, if you just happen to get the coronavirus. You know, my family is from Indianapolis, Indiana, and there are some people in my pers personally, in my family that have died from the coronavirus. And, you know, there are more people back there that have died from it. But here where I live in Salt Lake City, Utah, I personally don't know anyone who's actually died from it. Uh, we're one of the lowest states, uh, in the lowest four states uh, in the country with, uh, you know, who've actually contracted or died from this virus. But uh, let's go on. I want to just talk to you about some things that we can do. Exercise. You want to get a half hour to an hour of good exercise, whether it's resistance training or whether it's cardiovascular. If, if they will allow you in the state that you're in to walk, then by all means, make sure you do some walking for cardio. Get out as much as you can. Get some vitamin D and that type of thing. But exercise a half hour to one hour. Number two, you want to make sure that you're eating well. Eat good nutrition, well-balanced meals to get you through this so that uh, this is something that you don't contract. And I'll, I'll talk to you a little bit about what not to eat in just a moment. It's one thing that I, I want you to stay away from uh, as far as ingesting and eating. Next, supplementation. Make sure you, you have some good supplementation. There are some things that you have just around your house that you could eat that will help build your immune system and fight against uh, you know, uh, the coronavirus, such as uh, cayenne pepper. It's not only is it a thermogenic, but it heats up the body. You know, when you eat something really, really hot and your head starts to sweat, that's because, uh, and if you have germs and that kind of thing, that cayenne pepper uh, starts in on it. I mean, you've got ginger that you have in your cabinet. You have uh, things like uh, ginger, uh, uh, garlic, onions, things like that help to build your immune system and fight against germs and, and that kind of thing. So good supplementation. Along with that, uh, you want to make sure that prayer and meditation. Prayer, what prayer does, it takes all the pressure off of you and it puts it on God. It takes all the pressure off of you and you're putting your trust and it brings about a calmness, the person that prays. Meditation is another one. Uh, there are studies on prayer and meditation, how it helps to build your immune system and puts you in a better state of mind. So prayer and meditation. Sleep. Sleep is so utterly important, guys. You need at least six to eight hours of sleep. If you do these things, it's going to help build your immune system. That's what this uh, virus is, is coming against. If you're overweight and obese, if you're diabetic, if you've got heart problems, uh, your immune system is low. And you want to make sure you eat foods that are anti-inflammatory. Get rid of that inflammation uh, that you have in your body. Cardiovascular really helps with that also. Now, the thing that you want to stay away from, you really want to stay away from stress. Stress. Anything that's extremely stressful. Anything that's extremely stressful, you want to stay away from it because that assists in your immune system declining. And we want to increase uh, the antibodies and we want to increase your immune system so that you can fight against this thing. Uh, the other thing you want to stay away from is sugar, 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 sugar during this time. Uh, one thing that sugar does, it makes your body extremely acidic. The molecules are very, very similar to vitamin C. And what that means is they fight for space in the cell. If they fight for space in the cell, what happens is if you eat sugar, it has the ability to knock your immune system out for up to five hours. So once your immune system has been knocked out because of the consumption of sugar, you're, 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 you're open and susceptible to whatever's going on in the air. 
So sugar is one that you want to stay away from. Sugar also makes your body very, very acidic. Another thing you want to stay away from is, this is, some of you are going to get mad at me, but you need to be really careful with this, and that's D-R-I-N-K-I-N-G. And during this time, there are some things that have increased tremendously, and uh, uh, drinking is one of those things. Drinking, it suppresses your immune system, makes your body very, very acidic, dehydrates the body, along with so many other things. So, this is my way of saying I love you and giving you some information to build your immune system to fight against the COVID-19. And also, it's just good for you whether it's COVID-19 or not. So, we want to build the immune system and stop doing some things. Make sure you get rid of the stress. You know, get rid of... I can't say get rid of all sugar, but this is refined sugar. You can do that. Get rid of the refined sugar. When I'm talking about sugar, I'm not talking about carbohydrates or complex carbohydrates even that are converted to sugar in the body. I'm talking about the refined sugar. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. And drink it. So these are things you want to do. These are things you want to move away from. I hope you like this uh, video. If you do, I want you to give me a thumbs up. I want you to share it. I don't want you to lose anybody. And I don't want to lose you. So stay healthy, guys. I love you. Coach.